Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should go through the highlights. And I don't make a lot of videos, but when I do, I got reasoning. And this one goes to Alexander D. My dog! No, not my dog. He's not my dog. He's not my friend. He's a piece of trash. Okay, so he thinks he knows about this whole Pitbull and Little Wayne's Beast thing, right? Ha 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 ha! That is so funny. That makes me laugh. He can't even talk right. Anyways, I don't normally make fun of people, but I make fun of him because he don't know, like, nothing. He talks about Pitbull like he knows everything. But basically, like, he start, started saying his BS, right, about Pitbull. Like, Pitbull can't rap and this and the third. Alright, Alexander D., I'm going to lay it to you straight. Okay? You said that Pitbull stole something from the Harlem Shake. Let me give you a news flash, mister. People have been stealing music since from the beginning of time. Back when black people weren't allowed to put their music on the radio and the white people took their song and got credit for it. That was stealing direct. It wasn't even borrowing a beat and using it. It was stealing the whole song. It's been happening from the beginning of time. Everybody does it. They take a beat and they flip it and they use it. And everything that Pitbull has taken, people are cool with. They're not like, oh, well, he stole that from me and he shouldn't have that. AHA was cool with when he took the the thing from AHA. He was cool with, AHA was cool with that. The take on me, the do 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 But anyways, people have been doing it since the beginning of time. He's not the only one that's done it. He's not the only one that will do it. And it's been going on forever. Second of all, you need to stop talking like this. You think you know everything and you got your own little cell. Okay, it's Alexander D. And this is a rap talk. I'm sorry, but really? <laughs> and, okay, let me correct you because this has been bugging me. It's Dade County. D A D E. Dade, not Dade County. Or whatever the fuck you said. It's Dade County. Okay? And Pitbull used to be a rapper. Alright? But let me tell you something. Rapping to him was like crabs in a bucket. What's crabs in a bucket? Let me explain to you since you probably don't understand this and don't know one damn thing. Okay, somebody is like, oh yeah, they notice an up and coming person. They're like, oh yeah, I'm gonna help you. You're awesome. Let's get you up here in this business. This business. And then, once they get them up in there and help them, maybe they get an award or two. They s albums start to get out and they're like, oh yeah, that's really cool, you know? That's awesome. Then all of a sudden they start getting up there and it's like, well, now it's like doggy dog. Because it's like, okay, now they're fighting. Like, yeah, some people might collab when they do rap stuff, but rap isn't the thing anymore. It's more the club music now. Like, there's still rap. People still listen to it. Still somewhat popular. But it's this club music, this pop music that has become popular now, and you have to move on. You can't be stuck in 1997 with Ice-T and Snoop Dogg. It's pop music now. Alexander D. Okay? You don't know one thing about Pitbull. So, here's some advice to you. Get your facts straight before you make a rap talk video. Okay? And the reason he used a song about the heat, Lil Wayne was dissing on the Miami heat. Lil Wayne just prances in Miami and thinks he, he's some goddess. Pitbull's like, uh-uh. You ain't talking about the heat that way. You ain't dissing nobody like that. Not in my city. Not in my town. And he lives everywhere in the Miami 305 area code. If it was, if the area code was 305, he lived there at one point in time in his life. You have no right to start talking trash, Alexander D. So until you know what the fuck you're talking about, shut up. Because as far as I'm concerned, Little Wayne can go stick it where the fucking sun don't shine. Because he has no right to be disrespectful. He had no right to say what he said. And I am forever and will always be a Little Wayne hater. Because Little Wayne's some black dude trying to act like something he ain't. I'm not saying that he's a bad rapper. Because his music's right. But personally, Little Wayne is a dick face and he can go suck it. Alright?
And you need to stop talking BS. Okay? Till you know what you're talking about. And you ain't know what you're talking about. Because you talk about Pitbull like you know him. And you ain't know nothing about Pitbull. So I would shut your fucking mouth, Alexander fucking D. And yeah, 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 it's your girl DJ Highlights. And I'm checking in. I'm checking out. Because I'm done with this BS. So you know what? As Pitbull would say, Dolly, you!